Hello, friends. This is your Congressman Al Green, the original sponsor of the original Black History Month resolution. I'm proud of this year's theme, which is Hallowed Grounds, Sites of African American Memories. Many of the memories are not pleasant, and we still have to acknowledge them, however, because they are part of our history. So let's walk through some of the memories. The first will be the 1954 decision in Brown versus the Board of Education. Topeka, Kansas has a school board site. That's hallowed grounds because of what happened at that school board to cause young African-American children not to be able to attend schools with others. Let's move forward to 1965 and the Edmund Pettus Bridge. Hallowed grounds because at the Edmund Pettus Bridge, we have what occurred as Bloody Sunday. And as such, it led to the Voting Rights Act being approved by the Congress of the United States of America and signed into law by President Lyndon Johnson. So the Edmund Pettus Bridge will become and is hallowed grounds for African Americans. But I'll talk now about the most exciting part of hallowed grounds. I believe the most positive and most exciting part of this is what occurred in Washington, D.C. in 2009. Because in Washington, D.C., in 2009, a man stood on the Capitol grounds. He raised his right hand. He was sworn in by the Chief Justice of the Supreme Court of the United States of America. And when he lowered his hand, he became the first African American President of the United States of America. Indeed, the Capitol itself has hallowed grounds. It has memories. It is history. And I salute all of my colleagues who have joined me in this resolution. And I thank the President of the United States of America for issuing his proclamation concerning Black History Month. God bless you, and God bless the United States of America.